M0 FXB, welcome back to the channel. So we're here using the WPSD digital voice dashboard on DMR. The My hotspot is connected via Ethernet. If you look here in the background there, you should see my, my Ethernet flashing away. And it's an adapter that's connected to my Pi Zero. And I highly recommend you get one of those adapters because I use it quite often okay anyway so let's go back to what we're talking about and you'll see with the WPSD dashboard you get this nice live caller display which you can see on the top right and as stations are coming through they are displayed in this nice quick screenshot of information and then lots more information here but today this video is just about adding our Wi-Fi to our connection of course you can create a, uh, a, dub, a, a file using the WPSD Wi-Fi configuration generator you just put in your username and password and it creates a file you can slide that onto your SD card or you can use Ethernet and just do it this way so just watch what we do we're going to go to admin just here then configuration just here scroll all the way to the bottom and you'll see that we are not connected to Wi-Fi it says here interface is inactive now you can do this with most systems you, you know you don't have to use WPSD but anyway so uh, let's have a look here we're gonna go to scrolling down configure Wi-Fi and then we're gonna select to search for Wi-Fi or should I say the word scan scan for Wi-Fi just here click scan and it's going to work no different than your mobile phone does it's going to find the Wi-Fi's that you would like to connect to and I'm going to use the one here called Mercury 10 so we'll go select and then we're going to put in our password just here and go save this network so in theory, we're going to disconnect the Ethernet cable and it will connect. So let's give it a go. I'm just going to unplug the cable. We might have to reboot. Might fiddly reaching across. Okay, disconnected the cable. It's gone silent at the moment. We'll go back to the dashboard. Remember, I'm not really teaching this. I'm doing it and you're watching me. If you want proper instructions, go to the WPSD forum, Facebook, instruction manual, and um, they'll give you the instructions. But I'm at home tinkering with gadgets and you're watching me. I got a feeling that once you change from Ethernet to Wi-Fi that your IP address does always change. So we're gonna to go to my IP searcher. The one I recommend you use is called advanced IP scanner which is a free download and it scans everything on your network whether it's wireless or Wi-Fi and it also it would say in it whatever your your Wi-Fi is called or your WPSD is called mine is called Pi Star WPSD so I'm just going to reboot it just by unplugging it and plugging it back in and if you look here Pi Star WPSD has come back with 105 at the end so I just put that in on the left as you can see and we are now connected via Wi-Fi. Sounding good as well. The other nice thing about using this dashboard is you can update the firmware on your hat. We have a hat here. And hopefully, if you've got the right hat, you'll be able to use M17. We're not going to do that in this video. We'll do it in another video, but that tool is here. Thanks for watching. This video was about Wi-Fi, WPSD Digital Voice Dashboard. Bye for now, 7-3.